the biggest biggest play of the game was probably where uh, Justin Fields got hit by shit. I, I lost the name of the Clemson linebacker who was ejected for targeting, but <laughs> basically folded Fields in half with a hit to the back and um, sat, sat out one play and came back in and threw a touchdown pass. Uh, there's, <laughs> I mean, that's amazing enough, but when you, there's so many things that happen on that play that kind of kind of turn the game, and that's where yeah. Ohio State just went on and dominated. But I mean, first of all, the hit. I, I'm I'm guessing you saw the hit. Um, yeah, I saw the hit. This is where you know I, I'm I'm much more into Twitter and social media, sports social media, since we've been doing this podcast and we've been doing a baseball podcast and a blog for years. But I've noticed college football fans are more irrational than anyone, certainly and certainly more than baseball fans. Um, which is kind of amazing, but just seeing how Twitter exploded after that hit and the ejection of line, Clemson linebacker for targeting. And, you know, people were just talking about how it was a, a textbook tackle and, you know, he should not have been ejected and it was just ridiculous. And they're, they're throwing the game, the refs are throwing the game for, for Ohio state, which is laughable, but um, <laughs> it just proves that people don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Cause literally the, there's four bullet points that define what targeting is for college. The fourth bullet point is lowering your head and using the crown of your helmet. And that's, that's literally what the linebacker did. He lowered his head and used the crown of his helmet to make the hit. If it's not hitting him in the head, it's not, it had nothing to do with the actions of Justin Fields spinning at the last moment had nothing to do with any of that. It's literally the actions of the player. That, that's why they wrote the rule that way. So you can argue you don't like the rule, and there there are issues I have with the rule. But you know, being ejected automatically for targeting, I think it's I think that's 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 a bit much. Yeah. But the the lowering your head and hitting with the crown is to for the safety of the tackler, not the tacklee. So, and that's that's why they wrote that in there to you know for safety on both sides of that that kind of play. So. For people to say it's not targeting, there you're literally couldn't be more 100% wrong. It's the dictionary definition of targeting, and you see it all the time. That that same player has been ejected multiple times for that same play. So, it just makes me laugh that it keeps happening and people keep defending it. It's like, well, your problem's with the rule, not you. You're, that's the rule. That's literally what it is. <laughs>